What's going on YouTube? It's your girl Kid and I'm back with another video and in today's video we will be making the legendary LeBron James build. Alright, as you can see by looking at his badges, we won't be able to have those exact badge numbers but I guarantee you we will be getting very, very close to making this exact LeBron James build. Now with this video, I'm going to be showing you two different ways, two different ways on how to make a LeBron James build build all right so stay tuned all right so let's get right into it okay you know we got king james of course you no know, small forward right handed and we got to get that jersey number 23 all right so for the height we're gonna go with six seven because the stats are the attribute stats are way better at six seven so we're gonna go with six seven Okay, we're gonna go with six seven for the height and for the weight. Let's see. Now, the more you increase the weight, you know, it affects strength and interior defense and stuff like that, but it makes your speed with ball decrease. So, we're gonna go with we're gonna go with 230. And for the wingspan, you know, that affects most of your defensive stats and your shooting. So be really careful about that. You know, I'm just going to show you guys the build. Feel free to tweak it and customize it to your liking. But we're going to go with that for the wingspan. And you, this is, we're going to go with the built body shape, right? So. Okay, so we know LeBron is a very, very athletic player. We're going to start with the physicals. We're going to start with the physicals. Let's do that. We're not going to max out Vert. We're going to try to save some points in the end. But we're going to max everything else out. I'm, remember, guys, I'm showing you guys two different ways to make this LeBron James build. So stay tuned. I'm going to show you two different ways to make this build, all right? This is the one. This this way right here is going to be with the max physical, physical attributes. This build is going to be very, very athletic. Very athletic. So let's move on to the finishing. It doesn't have to be max, completely maxed out for the driving dunk. We take that back a few points. And we got to give him some standard dunk. We're going to leave it like right there. Let's see. Then we can take this close shot down a bit. If you want 15 finishing badges, you can, you know, leave your close shot at 77. But for the purpose of this video, we're going to leave it right there. Let's go on to the shooting. I know now y'all probably like, whoa, wait a minute, only three shooting badges? I'm telling you, I'm showing you guys two different ways to make this build, okay? Two different ways. Just stay with me. Stay with me. Y'all gonna see what I'm doing here. Gotta get those playmaking badges. Got to, got to, got to. Now on to the defense. These def defensive badges are, are really tricky, all right? So, like you see right now, a 70 with a 73 block, I still can't even get an Intimidator. I can't get Intimidator at all. Like you see, I have to have my block at at least a 74 to be able to even get, get Intimidator. So, that's some stuff you want to keep in mind. And then if you want Chase Down Hall of Fame, you see, to get Chase Down Hall of Fame, your block has to be an 81 with this particular build and then if you want rim protect the hall of fame you gotta have your block at a 82 but that is totally up to you guys it's totally up to y'all it's totally up to y'all so you could do it like that if you want to get your hall of fame chase down hall of fame rim protector but if you want to 
Oh wait, we really don't need steal. We're gonna take we're gonna take this steal away. Give us some more on rebounding. Give us some more on rebounding, and then you're able to get box. But you can also, if you don't want necessarily want your block that high, you know, you can play around with this and take some away from your block and put it on your rebound and stuff like that until it it looks it looks good to you. Okay. So this is the first way, you guys. This is the first way. You see, we got max physical attribute stats. This build is going to be insane. This build is going to be insane. You're going to be jumping out the roof with this vertical. And then you have to consider that you still get the plus four to your attributes once you get 99 plus four to all your attributes plus your physical attributes so that is going to be crazy then on top of that gym rat and all the other things like boost and stuff play a part in that so this build is going to be crazy it's going to be really really crazy all right so these are the takeovers that you get to choose from you can choose whichever takeover you like for the purpose of this video i believe we are going to go with finishing moves and extreme clamps all right so this way if you make the build this way you get a two-way slasher but you see right there shades of lebron james and that is exactly what we want all right, guys, so that is the first way that you can make this LeBron James build. But I did tell you it is another way. Like, if you are not satisfied satisfied with just three shooting badges and stuff like that, I do have another way to make a LeBron James build with more shooting. So, I'm going to show you guys that right now. So, we take this back. The only thing you pretty much want to do... The main focus I would say is play around with your physical attributes. Okay, so if we knock down the vertical and the strength, that will give us more points that we can add back to some add back to our shooting stats. So we knock the strength and stuff down. Put that back up here. You see, we're already at 8. Then let's take away of some of the some of the playmaking. Now, beware, once you take away some of the playmaking, you're going to lose some badges. Like you lose like since we've taken away pass accuracy, we lose needle threader and floor, and floor general. But there you got it. Now you got 10 shooting badges. Alright, so now I did some playing around with this. You can make the build just like this. Like, if you can, just like this, and it will still say Shades of LeBron James. Now, the difference is compared to the other LeBron James build. Remember, I showed you guys how you can get your Intimidator and your Chase Down and chase down a rim protector on hall of fame notice that this one this build just so it can still say shades of lebron james i had to knock down the block attribute down to 70 so beware if you still want your intimidator and your chase down and your rim protector on hall of fame and stuff like that you have to have your block higher it got to be in that 80 to 82 range to get those badges but i had to knock it down just so the build can say shades of lebron james like if you make your block higher but increase the shooting and stuff like that it's not going to shade say shades of lebron james in the end i'm just throwing that out there i just want you guys to know that's going to be pretty much the only main difference in these two builds so now as far as your takeover you see now you can choose from a couple sharps you to take over so let's go with let's go with limitless range and finishing moves and we have a two-way score machine and it still says shades of lebron james 
right there all right so that is pretty much it for this video I really hope you guys enjoyed it. Make sure that you leave a like, comment down below, and subscribe to the channel if you are new. Feel free to fully customize this build or make some necessary tweaks or edits where you need to, where you are most comfortable. These are this. It is going to be your build, accommodated to your play style. I was just here, you know, showing you guys how to make a potential LeBron James build and guiding you along the way. But most importantly, thank you all for watching and make sure you hit that subscribe button and turn on those notifications and stay tuned to my next video.